everyone. So <laughs> today, I'm, as you can tell by the title, or if you read the title of this video, I'm going to make a blog today because the saddle fitter is coming and reflocking, observing my saddle and all that good stuff. So I'm pretty excited about that because I'm ready for my saddle to be straight and nice because it's literally crooked. If you haven't watched my November updates, my saddle is dressage. Dressage saddle is crooked. It's been bugging me because literally I had to scooch my saddle to the right and it'll still be crooked. And I did notice that a couple of occasions, but now coming towards it, I thought it wasn't a problem, but it actually is. It's not a huge problem, but it's a little bit because Actually, I don't know. But because he had to get this wave thing on his back or something like that. Um, I'm not 100% sure what is it called, but I'll put something up here. What exactly is it called? Um, but Peanut seemed to enjoy it a lot, so I'm very happy. I thought he would be like, wow, my God, what is on me? But no, he was very calm and really liked it. The chiropractor came this Friday and... He was doing something to his back and Peanut like flipped out, but um, the chiropractor is very nice and desensitized Peanut a little bit with what he was doing. So I'm very happy with that. And now the chiropractor said he needs a little bit of stall rest, two to three days, I believe. So I'm very excited for my saddle to get reflocked. What my trainer told me when my trainer was talking to the saddle fitter was she may have to take the saddle to totally redo it and stuff. So I'm hoping that she can do that. I did. My trainer did also say that my jumping saddle slash cross country saddle is also a little crooked, but not as crooked as the dressage saddle. So we don't really have to worry about the jumping saddle. Now, maybe in some other time I can do the jumping saddle, um, if it's not that big of a deal, but it was. Um, so I'm very happy that my dressage saddle is going to get flocked tonight. And yeah, so the saddle fitter is a little behind. So we're going to, so she's thinking around 8 o'clock tonight, which is okay. I'm more calm now than I was last year of not freaking out if I got home around 8 or 9 because I would freak out because then I want to get a good night's sleep for next day going to school but now I can just have school at my home because I'm homeschooled okay now I'm going to end the vlog I'm going to stop talking and see you guys in the car or at the barn bye got some candy cane chill Here's something. Here's something. <laughs> <laughs>